She was singular. Will never be another Val. She was at once an old sage and ageless. She could interact with anyone of any age group with an interest in anything. If they come up with a system like that and they mark something X-rated, you can bet your life that kids are going to want to buy it, <laughs> even if they never even thought about buying it before. People would just come in here and spend hours. I like to think I do the same. I mean, I had, we, I've had you know customers that come in here, pop a squad on the stage, and we'll talk about the Marvel Cinematic Universe for hours on end. I'm all about that. I've been the sole employee since she passed um, last July. It was no question that we'd been struggling for a long time. Um, I didn't quite know how bad it was. The state is very, like, very likely by the end of the month that it'll be it. Um, there's a small sliver of hope that something might come through between now and then that I can't really speak to, um, but fingers crossed, knock on wood, we'll see. There might, there might be an angel in my corner. The entire concept is heartbreaking. Of course, you know, this place means the world to me. It has been my world for almost two decades. So there's that. Um, seeing people, you know, coming through and a lot of people expressing their, you know, love for the place. Uh, some, you know, sometimes it's like very, very touching. Other times it's like, I don't love to hear when people come in, they're like, oh man, you know, I used to shop here all the time in the 80s. And I'm like, Rewind and play that back for yourself right now, considering the situation. <laughs> you know, it's like that, uh, you know, that, that hurts a little bit. If a miracle happens between now and then, I hope that I get as much attention on that note as I get for potentially closing the store. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.